<clears throat> it's a good thing Set missed. Because Garrett hit 14 points. Nice. Good work, dog mate. Alright, so I'm going to have to heal. While I'm here, I might as well throw on that uh, SMG too. Let's forget to click the button and switch. You know what? They really haven't lined up anymore. If they were still in a line, actually. I'm going to have to end my turn anyways, and I'll be able to see oh, who's in what position. That's pretty smart for that guy. Good boy, dog meat. Get out of here. I know if I don't shoot this guy, he's going to start chasing dog meat. Take two steps into this room. Hopefully they line out. Apparently I'm pulling those guys. It's one down. Plan is working. Slowly. Two down. Perfect. Now, they both hit pretty hard, and I don't kill one of them, then I'd be screwed. But, killed the ghoul guard, so it's all good. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to heal. Much as I would love to leave it. Fifty three should be all right. Oh, right. I'm like, why can't I again? It's because I don't have the AP for it. mean set here. Nice. Should be able to kill him if I hit him. I missed. Go ahead and reload. But the battle already ended. Set was the the biggest person I want to look at because I figured get all my stuff back from him. Not that I really wanted it, but the hell are those? Flamethrower fuel. That could be extremely useful. I literally can't pick up, like, anything else. I already checked that. I do want that Guns and Bullets magazine. Yeah, I can't pick up, like, Diddly Squat. Drop that for a second so I can pick up that. Then I'll read it. Yeah, pretty much as soon as I make it to the hub, I might just off screen run back and forth and trade as much as I can. Just so I can, uh,.
but used to all the stuff I have. All the stuff I would be getting and whatnot. Hello, friend. Never fear. So I reckon most of these goals probably have something, considering, like, the one here had, like, a pole arm. Do need to get in an okay position where I can see uh, dog meat so I can doctor on him. Failed to do any healing. Well, that's some bullshit. Fuck off. That's why I hate doing stuff with your companions. Didn't even see that ice chest, so it's a good thing I kind of came back, or... You know what? If you want to die, I'll let you die. So that's how it's kind of feeling right now. There's the assault rifle ammo, by the way. And an assault rifle in there, of course. I'll take it for now. Mainly I'm just here looking for like bottle caps and skill books. It's locked, eh? Play. I'd like to think I've learned my lesson right now. Who knows, it could be trapped. You haven't quite gotten this lock yet. Meaning... I don't think I can open that. I doubt I can just kind of rest up, right? Yeah. I mean, I could go to the underground and rest up from there. This, probably, this guy's probably going to aggro on me, so I might as well take care of him. Yeah. Dog meat's still injured. Well, this guy has to be close. Yeah, he is. Really don't want to push into there yet. It's not what I want to look at actually. Character sheet. I'm close to leveling up on the good side. My karma's been going up too. As morbid as that is actually. <laughs> or maybe no, maybe it's because I turned in that quest actually. That's probably what it is. Has to be. Psycho. It's the first time we've seen Psycho in this playthrough. It's just another uh, drug. You take it and it stupidly increases your strength. Kind of like buff out, but Psycho also makes you have more health or something. Resistance, I think. I think it's resistance. Look at it here in a second. Should tell us. 
So it increases the combat potential of a soldier. I mean, that's pretty vague, but I'm pretty sure it's like resistance and stuff. The dog may start running away. He's like, nope, I can't do this. Figure I might as well get the free XP off of these guys. Even though I'm pretty sure this is a war crime. We just won't tell anyone. If I do this, though, it should help me level up. He's like, I don't want to fight. Just ends the uh, combat on me. I was going to say it ends it then, but it doesn't end it now. But it's because Dogmate was taking his turn. Dogmeat gets a turn, you know. Apparently I missed that shot. Knocked him down. And I guess he's just he's just done. We're not fighting anymore. That only needed like a hundred more experience. Maybe it was like a thousand more experience and I read it wrong. Must have been. I've obviously had more than a hundred experience here. Uh, character. Yeah, it was a thousand experience. But again, I am still close to it. I mean, I'm sure if I clear out all the uh, ghouls in this next area, I can get it. I really want to activate this right here and see if it, uh... It just blew up. In any case, though, I have to heal. It's a must at this point. No idea what the uh, 10 minutes and 30 minutes rest would be for. It's probably going to be nighttime by the time I get up there. Hopefully it isn't, but... Ah, uh, cool. Because... I'd much rather be, uh... Shit, actually. Because of what I'm facing, I'm going to do it this way. I don't think any of them actually have any guns, which is nice. Fuck. Not what I wanted to do. Might as well reload. That one bullet. I was going to wait anyways for them to get closer, and then I decided against it. Turns out it wouldn't have been the worst idea in the world, so hey. One guy ran away. He's like, nope. Nice. 
I don't think I hit. Oh yeah, I hit the guy in the back for nine points. <clears throat> I figured that was probably the most optimal shot. Nice triple kill. That that's golden right there. And my turn. And I leveled up. So, let's go to the character sheet. And take a look at everything here. So, what does big guns actually constitute? It constitutes mini guns, rocket launchers, flamethrowers, and such. So, what I basically expected. Anything super big. <clears throat> Energy weapons should be pretty self-explanatory. So, small guns is still what I want. And I have that 100%. I don't know if I need to dump any more points into lock picking. Although, I don't think I can open that thing behind me there. So let's bump it up to 75. And we'll see. That way they don't get out. Nice. Take all that if you're offering. So then for the rest of these nine points. It's a tough one. I was thinking maybe first aid. Because doctoring is really only for bigger... Bigger things, right? Put that up to sixty. I can do first aid on myself. Interesting. Do first aid on dog meat though. Does that mean he's good then? Assuming that means he's good. He's running around. Not quite done, though. I think I will leave the, uh... The SMG. On burst. Until I figure this out. Just because it will help me clear out this area quicker. Killed the one to damage the other. I hit 86 points at one point. Jesus. That first guy I shot at. The only reason I'm constantly reloading, by the way, is just because I have two extra action points anyways. I figure I might as well not do that. Do this. But I might as well do it at the end of my turn anyways. Because, like I said, considering I have the extra action points, I think it's only two left. So I'll be fine to handle with my shotgun here. Not that I couldn't handle all those guys with my shotgun. I just figured it was easier. And it definitely was. It would have took longer. And it might not have gone as smooth. Another shot to the head should do it. Nope. I mean, I did get a critical on that first guy. That's why. Blasted right through him, but... What the hell is this junk? They have to have something good over here, though. Beers. I don't really care about... I 
Because I feel like that's the only reason this area was full of guards. Gang members. What the hell is that? A backpack? I think it is. So I don't know if the backpack actually does anything in this game. I think it's just one of those uh, miscellaneous loots. Grenades and assault rifle ammo. Which I'll probably have to come back for. I mean, it wasn't the worst uh, thing in the world. Pretty sure that was... Been almost everyone except for... Uh, the gang members in this building. How am I looking at? Not bad. I don't know if I can run all the way there. Uh All in all, I'm almost done over here, which is nice. <clears throat> I don't think I can heal, though. Because there's still technically enemies, quote-unquote, around here, so... <clears throat> we will get my healing on. Up to 73 hit points now. That's not bad. Still only healing... Two? Yeah. Well, that's not bad. It's better than one because, I mean, if I had to heal one point every six hours, to get to 73 from 29, it would take... Well, let's see here. Seven minus two would be uh, five. Minus one more would be four. Nine minus three. Uh... Oh, shit. It's done. Take about, I would say probably about 40 or so. So that would be 40 times 6. Over 240 hours, to say the least. No, because that's every 6 hours. Jesus, it's retarded. It's ridiculous how long it would take. Now, there's a fair amount of guys in there. And they're probably going to aggro as soon as I come around the corner. See, I shouldn't have done that because now I have this guy behind me here. So, let's burst him first. Yeah, I can kill him. Because I'm fine with everything here. This wasn't fine with being sandwiched between two ghouls. I don't think any of them have any actual weapons. I did not know there was a guy in the back. Dogmate's just not going to fight back? Okay. If I move, all three of these ghouls are going to get out of here. That's not what I want to do. I mean, if he was really injured, though, I would hope that he would run away. That's the thing. There we go. I don't know why it took him so long to hit back, but he finally did. I only got one more guy left in this room before I can uh, run over there and help dog meat out. Nice. Good work. <clears throat> wow, that guy just took that burst and ate it. <laughs> and he's running away. I don't blame him. Don't blame you at all, sir. Take my two steps into the room. Let's go for a torso shot. That way it's guaranteed. Don't 
need those. Don't need that. Simply because there's nothing there. Oh, there's a dresser here. I would have missed that. 100%. The little gang house has been destroyed. I kind of want to say I'm pretty much done in Acropolis. I can always come back here if I need extra of anything, but. I like to think I'm done. <clears throat> I'm gonna go ahead and throw my hunting rifle back on my uh, slot two there. Let's head to the hub, because we haven't been there yet. Can't remember if it's a pain in the butt to try to get out of or not. We'll find out. I have a lot of things to trade, though. So it's a good thing we're heading here. No, I think I can literally just turn around and run. I want to go like that, though. Caravan drivers. John. He's probably the one I want to talk to here. Okay, that's... It said I seen scrub. I'm like, what the hell? I'm like, where did I see scrub then? What is this? What a load of crap. This guy has nothing. Really, I should probably store some of this stuff. Just find a spot and just put it there. Another two would bring me up to six. It's worth 300 caps. Wow. Wow. Forty-eight. Worth like a hundred caps. Mentates are worth way more. Sixty-seven. I get rid of another two. Fifty-one. I think that's the closest I'm gonna get. So I'll come up here. Need to offer eight bottle caps. Hmm. What are you doing here or out here at this hour? I'm a security guard hired by the merchants who own the gar goods in these carts. Dangerous job, but it pays well. Just the overnight, uh, just the other night, one of my coworkers was killed while watching over the caravans. What is this place? This is the hub. It's a trade center for the wastes. Um, it's the biggest city I know of, and you can find just about anything you want here. And if you're looking for air work, there's this place to be. Uh, it seems anyone here will hire you for something, even if it's not legal. Hmm. Well, if he's the overnight person, what I'm going to want to do then is rest until morning. Another two hours on top of that, just to make it eight. Let's see Matt, just go ahead and talk to Matt. He has nothing. What a waste of my time. I thought you actually had goods. Talk to Luke then, I guess. Do you have anything to trade? Don't tell me you don't. Of course he doesn't. Why wouldn't you? I know there's a bunch of stores here. Because I was in the hub in my last playthrough. I just want to see if, you know... Did 
Dan and Dan's wife. Go on here and talk to Dan. Why, well, hello there, my friend, and welcome to the hub. Let me introduce myself. They call me Dan the Brahmin Man. I will and deal with all the merchants around here, offering my humble service for a low, low price. Uh, do you have anything to trade? I mean, we're at this place called the hub. It's the Merchant Central, and nobody here has anything to trade. What services do you offer exactly? Why, I manage the care for pretty much all the caravan wagons and Brahmin in these parts. If they ever need anything for the caravans, I'm the one they talk to. Hell, the big three deal with me exclusively. Well, I have to go, because I'm not really interested at this current second. I could change at a later date, but... There's actually no one in there. Deputy Fry... Talk to the deputy here. He's gonna probably want to try to give me a quest. No, he doesn't. Hello, friend. Deputy Fry at your service. Tell me you have something to trade, please. He does. It's really all I want. 274. I'm thinking about getting rid of that dynamite. I just don't know. Like I said, if I reverse pickpocketed someone and threw it in their pocket, I'm pretty sure that would work out for me. One is 35, I believe. Two should be 70. I guess I'll pay the four cap difference. I'm slowly starting to empty my inventory out. But I mean, as much as I say that, I'm also kind of filling it too. But I think I'm emptying more than I'm taking. If that makes any sense. Um, Nice to meet you. Bye. And I'm actually going to end the video here. I think it's been about an hour. I'm not entirely sure. But I'm just going just gonna to say it has been. Farmers. Farmers. Anyways, though, when we come back, we will continue on. And I will look for more people to trade with. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like. If you didn't, say comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe and share. It really helps me out. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you later. Bye.